Hey, this is Sully for Anti Social News, and I'm still trying to catch up some of the old news. So, we're going to be starting the uh, week of April uh, 1st, the first full week of April there. Uh, so, Easter Sunday, we're going to do a little recap of some of the stuff that happened over the weekend leading up to that, and also that week there was some crazy truck bus stuff going on in the Philippines, there was some conflict going on in the Middle East, there's a lot of stuff leading up to a lot of other stuff that's happening now that we're looking at in a retrospective way. And uh, I think it's really interesting to look at news in a retrospective way because here in DC, the same news now is what was the big news then, which was this next big political thing is going to take down the president. And, you know, I, I'm i not trying to, like, break anybody's heart, but if, this is a month and a half ago. You fast forward a month and a half into the future, it's still, it's still the same story. It's just, well, this one's going to be the next one. Okay, there's actual news out there, people. Not opinions about things, but, but actual news stories are going on. We just talk about them, and let's let's talk about the news, not people's opinions about the news. Someone's opinion about the news story is not the news story. The news story is. I love seeing Trump doesn't deserve the Nobel Peace Prize for the North and South Korea Union. Now, you can take almost every bit of that out of there and just keep the actual news, which was. North and South Korea Union. That's the news right there. Leave Trump out. Your obsession with Trump, set it aside, actually talk about the news. Sorry, I know I'm losing friends here, but it's anti-social news. That's, I just want people to maybe stop trying to impress their friends, stop trying to virtue signal, and just talk about the actual life or death news. Check the link list below. I have sourced from Times of India, Ynet News, Vanguard Nigeria, AfricanNews.com, and Irish Times, and other wonderful news sources, legitimate news sources from around the world. No crackpot blogs or anything like that. I only find legitimate news from legitimate sources around the world. If you have a news story that you were following at the beginning of April that you want to be included to that list, I can edit this list at any time. It's in the description below. Uh, check it out, and thank you for watching Anti-Social News. <sighs> Cheers. Hey, thanks for watching. Check out patreon.com slash antisocial news and consider becoming a patron. I do post Patreon exclusive video for my paid subscribers there. So check out the full antisocial news experience.